Hello there. How's everybody doing? Happy close out to another good week in lawn care. Started off a little rough, but you know in this business, you gotta have some rain, like the song say, to appreciate the sunshine. <laughs> well, I hope everybody's doing okay. Uh, yeah, we started off Monday and Tuesday, rain, 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 day and night, so. Everybody that's in this business knows the story when that happens. But I'm not going to complain because where would we be without the rain? Good question, huh? Okay, today, um, first I'd like to thank the uh, new subscribers. I believe these are young ladies. Um, Jar Landscaping, if I pronounced it correct. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for commenting. Really enjoyed watching some of your videos and watching your uh, business grow. Here in my... Uh, 10 by 10 and they'll know if they watch this video what I'm talking about there but um, lawn care 101 rookie mistake today um, as I've said before occasionally I will do uh, some properties for a realtor I've been working with for maybe four or five years he'll text me an address and um, you know say hey I'm getting ready to close. Can you go by and take care of this property? So, got a text last night. No problem. Pulled it up on Google. Went to the property. Pulled up. Got out. Walked the yard. And the same time I'm walking the yard, I'm talking on the phone. That might have been my mistake right there. And uh, as I'm walking around, I notice, I say, well, there's a lot of things in this yard for this to be a uh, you know new property and people moving in. I said, well, maybe they came by and dropped some things off. Well, kept walking the yard and making sure, you know, nothing in the grass or whatever. Picked up a couple of items. Went back to the trailer. Somebody probably know where I'm going with this. Unloaded the moors. And some told me, pull out my phone and double check. Because you know when you're using Google, you can be right in between a house and it'll say, bam, you're there. So you need to verify. Well, I didn't verify it because I was on the phone. And right when I got ready to uh, start the more, put my phone out and check. The address I was, the yard I was in, getting ready to cut was 609. The property I should have been at was 607 right next door. Lesson learned, rookie mistake, lawn care 101. Pay attention, look at the address, make sure you're at the right house. I know I'm not the only one that's probably done it, but the only one that may want to admit it. <laughs> okay, well, um, I've added a little footage of some uh, after. I didn't get any before today, but just a couple of properties and a little short story of a neighborhood, how I got in the neighborhood and how I acquired more properties um, since I've been in that neighborhood there. Okay, I hope everybody's had a great week and look forward to a super uh, great weekend. Happy Father's Day to all you dads out there. I'm the father of two. Um, my son is, ooh, it's embarrassing, isn't it? <laughs> 28, and my daughter's 23. Okay, take care out there, and happy Father's Day. Have a nice weekend, guys. Okay, here's a couple of afters. Um, and this one here, and the one next to it here. Uh, good story with the house next to this house that I'm standing in, house with the gray car. That was actually one of the first houses in this neighborhood that I got 10 years ago. And um, <laughs> you believe I, it was the worst yard in the neighborhood at that time. I, um, I don't know if it was a door 
tag or a card. It might have been a flyer, and I put $35 on it. The worst yard, and it has these houses have pretty good sized backyards. Ten years ago, and that guy called me, and on this street now, I have these two. Gotta love them when they're together, huh? And uh, down on the corner, those two that are together. But yeah, ten years ago, thirty-five dollars. And that's how I got in the neighborhood. I wouldn't accept anything in here now under 50. I mean, and I'm talking about probably would be 55 or 60 for sure. Well, I'm not gonna accept anything under 55 or 60 now. But yeah, so yeah. And the story with him now, he may go um, to Oh, months or so forth. He's got teenage boys. He's coming out the house now. And he'll do, um, they'll do their own. Then they'll call me and so forth. So, but there we go. All right. It's a yard here and the one next door. Someone was asking what kind of cut can you get from the ZT one? that shows up.